Hello, passionate Sailtic FC fans. This is Sailtic Central News, your exclusive source for Sailtic updates. Before we kick off, we appreciate the incredible support. If you love Sailtic, subscribe now, hit like, and let's build this community together. Now, on to the latest news, a warm welcome to new subscribers. Your support is crucial. Hail, hail! Todd Cantwell, a former Rangers player, has sparked a new wave of controversy following his recent comments in an interview. The Englishman, who moved to Blackburn on transfer deadline day for a modest fee of £600,000, has been at the centre of criticism for his unwillingness to mention Celtic directly. Cantwell, once hailed as the potential cornerstone of Rangers' future, has now left many questioning his impact. For a player who was expected to be a game-changer in Scottish football, this transfer fee seems surprisingly low. His tenure in Glasgow was marked more by bold statements and off-field spats than by significant on-pitch contributions. During his time in Scotland, Cantwell's behaviour often drew attention. He was involved in a high-profile clash with pundit Chris Sutton and made bold claims about his desire to surpass the Celtic captain in terms of success. These comments, however, have now come across as empty boasts rather than meaningful declarations. In his latest interview, Cantwell chose to refer to Celtic indirectly as the others, rather than acknowledging them by name. This subtle dig has fueled speculation that he is still nursing a grudge. While his comments might be seen as petty, they also provide a certain level of amusement. One might argue that Cantwell should have shown a bit more respect by referring to Celtic as the reigning champions, given that this was their status during his time in Scotland. Unlike Cantwell, Celtic has a history of letting their performances on the pitch speak for themselves, ultimately securing trophies as a testament to their success. The reality of Cantwell's situation is also a reflection of his current status in the football world. Despite previous links to lucrative Premier League moves, the 26-year-old now finds himself playing for Blackburn, highlighting a notable shift in his career trajectory. Before we proceed, subscribe to our channel and enable notifications to receive all exclusive news about Sailtic FC. Don't miss any details about your favourite team. It's extremely important for Sailtic FC fans. In a stunning revelation that's causing ripples across the football world, Cristiano Ronaldo, the legendary Portuguese forward, has reportedly made disparaging comments about Scottish football. The rumours, which have quickly garnered attention, suggest that Ronaldo, known for his remarkable achievements and outspoken nature, has questioned the competitive level of Scotland's top leagues. This potential slight from one of football's greatest icons has ignited a debate that transcends the pitch. According to sources, Ronaldo's remarks were made during an off-the-record conversation with sports journalists, where he allegedly criticised the quality of Scottish football, suggesting it lacks the intensity and flair seen in other European leagues. Such comments are particularly striking given Ronaldo's illustrious career, which includes stints in Portugal, England, Spain, and Italy, countries known for their strong football traditions. The timing of these comments, as Scottish clubs prepare for another exciting season, adds fuel to the fire of an already simmering controversy. Scottish football fans and pundits have been quick to respond, with many expressing their displeasure and disappointment. The Scottish Premiership, which boasts a rich history and passionate fan base, has often been overlooked in the broader European football discourse. Ronaldo's remarks have intensified the scrutiny on the league and its players, drawing a sharp line between the perceived prestige of Scottish football and that of the more dominant leagues in Europe. On the other hand, some observers argue that Ronaldo's comments could serve as a catalyst for positive change. By drawing attention to Scottish football, the league might attract more international interest and investment, potentially enhancing its global profile. The debate over Ronaldo's statements highlights the ongoing challenge Scottish football faces in elevating its status on the international stage. As the controversy over Cristiano Ronaldo's alleged criticism of Scottish football continues to make headlines, Celtic fans are being asked for their take on the matter. The Glasgow-based club, a cornerstone of Scottish football with a storied history and passionate following, represents a significant portion of the league's supporter base. The question on everyone's mind is, how do Celtic fans feel about Ronaldo's remarks? Many Celtic supporters, known for their fierce loyalty and pride in their team, have voiced strong reactions to the news. 
Some fans are offended by the perceived slight, feeling that Ronaldo's comments undermine the hard work and talent present in the Scottish Premiership. They argue that Celtic, as a dominant force in Scottish football, should be recognised for its achievements and the quality of its players, rather than being dismissed by an outsider. Conversely, there are Celtic fans who view the situation differently. Some believe that Ronaldo's comments could be seen as an opportunity for Scottish football to gain increased visibility. These supporters argue that any attention, even if negative, might lead to greater interest and investment in the league. They see it as a chance for Scottish clubs to prove their worth and demonstrate the competitive nature of the league on a larger stage. Overall, the reaction among Celtic fans is mixed, reflecting a range of emotions from indignation to optimism. As Scottish football grapples with Ronaldo's critique, the response from fans of one of its most prominent clubs will likely play a crucial role in shaping the broader narrative. Whether Celtic supporters view this as a challenge to be met or an opportunity to be seized, their opinions will undoubtedly contribute to the ongoing discussion about the league's place in European football. As the dust settles, it remains to be seen how Scottish football will respond to Ronaldo's critique. Will the league use this as an opportunity to prove its worth, or will it be overshadowed by the larger narratives of football's elite? One thing is certain, Cristiano Ronaldo's words have sparked a conversation that is far from over, and Scottish football will be keenly watching how this unfolds in the coming weeks. Hello, fan! Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, as it means a lot to Celtic FC. Also, share your opinion about the news in the comments below. See you in the next video.